Hello everybody, my name is Sir Rafael and I will be teaching you environmental studies for class 3. Now today we will be learning about our body. Now let's look at the first line. Read the following and name the body part being used in each situation. Tasting a delicious soup made by sister. Oh, what part of the, uh, what part of the body are you using to taste? Oh, <coughs> you know the answer, right? Right. So, for homework, you will be doing these fill in the blanks, right? Touching a hot iron. What do we touch with? Do we, do we touch with our hair? Do we touch with our eyes? Yes. Write down um, the answers for this, for homework, right? So, moving on. Our body has many parts. The parts that we can see are called external body parts. Hands, legs, nose, eyes and ears are some external body parts, right? So, everyone has hands. Do you have hands? Do you have legs? Do you have nose, eyes, ears? These are called external body parts that we can see right now some parts of our body are inside the body which we cannot see or oh, body parts <clears throat> body parts that we can see are external and body parts that we cannot see are internal what are some internal body parts they are the heart brains lungs stomach and kidneys right uh, body part <laughs> So, so external body part can be seen. So, internal body part can be seen. Internal body part can be seen. So, 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 internal body part can be internal body parts can be seen. Seeing, hearing, tasting, smelling, and touching are our five senses, right? Five senses, seeing, hearing, tasting, and touching. <coughs> now, these body parts help us to utilize these senses and know about the world around us. These are called sense organs. The eyes, the ears, the tongue, the nose and skin are our sense organs. Let us learn how they work. The eyes. Our eyes help us, to help us see things around us. We can observe the nature, watch films and read books using our eyes. Our eyes also show whether we are happy, sad or excited. When we are sad, our eyes fill with tears. When we are happy, our eyes twinkle. Next page, how do we see? We see only a part of the eye when we look in the mirror. The whole eye is like a round ball. The light from an object in front of us enters the eye through the pupil. Look at the diagram on your right. Look at the picture, right? You see where the pupil is? That is where the light enters our eyes, right? It passes through the lens. Look at the lens. Where is the lens? Behind the pupil. And then through the lens, it reaches the retina. Right? The retina is at the back of our eye. When a picture of the object is formed, the retina changes the picture into a message that the brain can read. The brain changes the picture into a picture that we can see. Right? <clears throat> So what happens is whenever we see things with our eyes, the light enters first the pupil and then behind the pupil is the lens, it goes through the lens and then finally it reaches the retina, right, where the picture of the object is formed. And then the retina changes the picture into a message that the brain can read, right. Now, some people have problems with eyesight, right. Now, when any part of the eye does not work properly, we may find it difficult to see clearly. Christina, Christine, Christy could not read the board from her seat. 
her mother took an took her to an eye doctor right an eye doctor is also called an ophthalmologist right o p t h o p h t h a l m o l o g i s t ophthalmologist this is an eye doctor kan mitat siatin mit doctor ne na kan kal thina to to a ming to ophthalmologist ani ophthalmologist ti ko ni the doctor examined and asked her to wear eye glasses they went to an optician who made her a pair of glasses now christy can see clearly see the blackboard right so what is an optician an optician makes our glasses right they make the glasses that we wear in case we need glasses ophthalmologist is an eye doctor optician is a person who makes glasses right learn the swing of the two watching too much television using mobile phone for a long time and reading in dim dim lights weakens the eyesight yes we should not watch too much television or use the mobile phone for a long time or read in dim lights as it weakens the eyesight kan mitte po acha theini tv enna satla tukin emo mobile phone man re emo a thim tham jinga thil chhiar tum te a thalo lu tukani chuwang chonin heng te hi tilo tur ani people who can see things that are far away but not things that are near are long sighted so they were thil mu the ma se nai te thil mu the lo riyo hi an omni chu chu long sighted kan ti thri na people who can see things that are close by but not things that are far away are called short sighted or nai te mu the a la de mu the lo hi short sighted an ti vele thung as people People grow old, their sight becomes weak, so they often need glasses to see clearly, right? And tarhuna atlang puin kum upalam tochu tar mitte anbun shi na ni an mita chakto lo vangin. Now braille, right? What is this braille? Some people are not able to see the world around us. These people are called blind or visually impaired. They use their sense of hearing, touch, and smell to know things around them. They use a special system called Braille to read and write. In this system, a person can use his or her fingers to feel different patterns of raised dots to read and write. It can be, be, even be used to read music. It is named after Louis Braille, who developed it. Right <coughs> now. <coughs> Mitchen hat mutei mialo, thil mutei mialo. Emo mitchalo te, mitchalo tak tak te an omvangin thil chiardan, an thil chiardan chikat, kong chikat. Zu braille an dia, hemi braille system kal mangin mutei mialo te, emo mitchalo te, po thil an lo chiar pa te in teni. Now taking care of the eyes. Complete the following sentences using the words from the box. Each sentence describes how we should take care of our eyes. Do not read or study in dash lights. Do not read in a dash vehicle. We should not, we should dash our eyes early in the morning. We should not rub our eyes with a dash cloth or hands. We must go to we must go for an dash regularly, right? So for homework I would like you to do the the exercise on page 11 and page 9 right page 9 and page 11 fill in the blanks all right thank you for joining me for this lesson my name is sir file and i will see you next time goodbye